Hi guys, it's Nessie Pooh when it comes to tarot. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so now. Sorry I've been gone for a little bit, but you know, you gotta get things together yourself. Um, this is going to be just for just a little small bonus for cancer because um, you guys video had cut short and it didn't make sense to like just put another two minute video up for the end of your reading. So this is just going to be like just small messages, quick little bonus uh, for messages to for June. Uh, I will be starting something new on my channel, which is um, life path numbers. So if you know your life path number then it would just be prayer meetings on what you need to know or what's coming towards you for your life path number. If you don't know what a life path number is, it's more of messages. It's more of finding out more about you specifically, um, what you agreed to in your past life before you came here, you signed the contract with your spirit guides, and said okay before i go here this is what i'm going to improve this is what i'm going to do it's basically your life purpose so if you would like to know find out your life path number if you don't know it you can email me and i will do that for you uh sorry i have sniffles a little bit bear with me our angel michael what messages do you have for cancer someone rising in venus for june i'm not gonna pull like all the other cards that i usually be pulling so we have fulfillment and wishes Ooh, and deception and envy have your card at the bottom of the deck so let's get down to it <laughs> I hope uh, no one is being deceptive or um... <sighs> okay maybe someone that made you happy you thought that was a wish is being deceptive towards you behind your back uh-oh, sorry. Behind your back, something sneaky going on. Or you could find out the person that you are, that really makes you happy. They could be hiding their true feelings from, from you. But let's find out. Let's clarify. Why is fulfillment and, of wishes here? Why is fulfillment of wishes same exact message fulfillment of wishes is basically the nine of cups so this person really make you happy i know that let's find out more tell me more please tell me more okay i wasn't ready Sorry, my table a little shaky. Because I don't have it sturdy like that. Okay, so what I tell you, this person makes you really happy. Two of cups, a banana of cups. Well, this person could be feeling this way towards you. Maybe you a wish fulfillment to this person. One more card, please. One more card. Wait a minute. See? I ain't gonna tell you. Let's just see if the card come back out again. Because those was two cards. I just want one. Thank you. Five of Cups came out in the reverse. So, you're no longer sad about something. This shirt just keep popping over. This is like getting on my nerves. Sorry. I'm going to need to go change the shirt in a minute. So, okay. You're no longer crying over spilled milk. You have realized that this person makes you happy. The roles could be vice versa. So, switch the roles if it's not you. Um, let's clarify this deception and envy. Because 
Just because you feel a way about a person doesn't mean that something sneaky ain't going on behind your back. So let's just see. Why is deception and envy here? Or just because a person um, feel this way about you doesn't mean that they're not still being sneaky. But it could just be they're hiding their true feelings about you. shaky so bear with me please so I find a, um, another location to really record so the king of pentacles so somebody could either <laughs> somebody could be acting like that they stable and they're not or they're stable in this relationship and they're not Get two more cards. So many. Why is deception envy here? Angel Michael, please reveal. Why is deception envy here? Uh oh. That's too many that flipped over. You're calling judgment on something. Okay, so the truth about to come out about something though. That's what I felt intuitively. So you're making a decision. Maybe you found out that somebody was being deceptive, and now you're making a decision on if you want to continue to move forward with this person. Because I don't think y'all feeling this person. Thank you. Oh, y'all was feeling this person. And this person made you happy, but maybe you find out that this person has been being very deceptive of you. Six of uh, uh, pinnacles. Let's see what I tell you. This person made you happy. You can have a family with this person. So maybe you feel you found out that this person was given into another situation. And y'all like, look, I don't know what you want. Thought we had something. You were making me happy. Excuse me, I'm sorry. You were making me happy. So what's what's really going on? But you're gonna make a decision about something. Well, this person could want a second chance, but I don't see. I don't really feel that though. I really feel like you making a decision about something. What messages do you have for Cancer, Sun, Rising, Venus for June 2020? Okay, so we have calling in your soulmate worth waiting for and give your relationship a chance. So maybe you decide to give this person another chance. Like I said, you maybe you find out that somebody was giving to another situation and you made a decision and you guys talked it out because this person really makes you happy. That that's what I'm seeing completely. Pull from this deck. I feel like something's on my face, y'all. I don't like people. I don't like stuff on my face. <laughs> why did I just have to sit up here? Let's see your intuition. Uh, why did I just make that face? I don't know. What messages do you have for Cancer, Sun, and Rising, and Venus for June 2020? A year from now, so 
communicate clearly and don't stop so that's why i said yeah, yeah. hold on because all the messages is coming in too quick that's why i say maybe you you decided to give a person a second chance and you guys talked it out <coughs> excuse me came to some type of agreement we're gonna give you advice Ooh, advice that you have for cancer summer rising in venus for june 2020 for love I think I'm coming down with a cold, y'all. Thank you. So, value your self-worth. Your You are God's precious child. So, if you decided to give this person another chance, make sure that you still remember who you are. And don't settle for less. If this is think clearly on if this is really what you want to do on giving this person another chance, um, that's you know we have free will. Not telling you to don't do it, but maybe this person could have changed. So that was you guys. Quick bonus. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you guys would like to book a personal reading with me. Everything is in the description box. If you would like to, if you think this resonated, drop comments down below. I love you guys, and I will be seeing you guys later. Bye, boo-boos.